All right, Sandy, I think this is what you're wanting to do. So I opened up a Google Sheet and gave it a name. Uh, so you might maybe name it your class period or whatever. And if I'm understanding you right, you're going to have speakers or presenters, or maybe in your case they're signing something to the class. So you would put them, the presenters' names, across the top. Uh, so presenter 1, presenter 2, presenter 3. And then down the left side, you're going to list... Uh, your students in the class. Uh, so I just put greater one, two, three. You would put every kid in, in the class. Then those kids, if I understand right, you want them all to be able to enter a score for each presenter. So greater one, Stevie, is going to give uh, presenter one, Bobby, a score of 88. And then you want it to average at the bottom like you see here. So uh, in order to do that, you basically are going to come down to whatever cell, uh, for example, if you have, uh, see we're starting with 2 here, uh, the column 2, so down to 26, so um, however many students you have in the class, you're going to list here, and then somewhere below the column for B, uh, you're going to uh, select that, so what I did here is I selected this one because it was below my last grader. And then up here, you're going to type in exactly what you see here, equals function equals average, open parenthesis. Then you're going to put the starting point, which I put B2, because B2 is right here, B, and then 2 is where my grades start, to B4, colon B4 and B4 is the 80, so then it averages them. So if you have, uh, you know, kids uh, down to space column 20, you would put B2 colon B20, and it would average everything between those two cells. And so then you would have to set that differently for each class. Uh, so it would take some work up front to list your kids across the top that are presenting and list your kids down the side that are grading and then you'd have to just go back in uh, and set the function at the bottom of each column. If that makes no sense at all, then I can come help you, or excuse me, you can come up uh, tomorrow afternoon. Hopefully that works. If that makes sense to you and you try it and it works, then, then we don't, you don't need to, to uh, you know, waste your valuable time. Uh, but I thought if I just sent this to you, maybe you could work on it and give it a shot on your own, um, and, and maybe you don't need me. Uh, so if that... Uh, makes sense to you, give it a shot, try it, and see if it works. Uh, just do an example like this. Then to share it, you're just going to share it like everything else. Um, so you can get your link and share the link with all the kids and make sure that it's on can edit so that they can actually go in and type in their scores. Uh, so again, hope that helps and just let me know if you need more help. Thanks.